Edgar, if, you, if you're trying to give a ticket, you can give that ticket to me. I slept in that tent last night. Yeah, I'll take that ticket, man. I slept in that last night. Yeah, I've, just, I've been chilling out. So right now, Edgar Padilla is going to try and look like he's got his ticket book to give uh, Daniel Egan another ticket. Um, even though it's my tent that I slept in last night. But he is... So Edgar, Edgar, I'm responsible for that tent right now. It is, it is where I slept last night, so I guess it is. Tip you, Roy. Too bad. I would encourage you to get a job if you're with your able body and you have lots of spare time, man. Oh, Robbie's doing a great job. Yeah. Thank you for your concern. Is that your tent or is that Daniel's tent? This, I wasn't this? quite sure yesterday when I asked you guys. Wasn't it the unions? Well, I can't, I can't speak on what they said yesterday, but as of now, this is... Hey, check it out. The, We're down right over their heads right now. <laughs> yeah, Lord have mercy on Some other poor shithead, you faggot. <laughs> I love talking to you, James. Yeah, suck a dick, faggot, sell out cop. Hey, y'all's following, eh? Hey, hey. Ain't getting too, with? With too much praise around here, huh? The good thing is, I'm not looking for exceptions from you guys. That's a great part. Are you 
No answer? I already told you where I slept last night. And I tell you that I'm a responsible for this tent right now. Right. We'll have one of the guys come in a second. All right. Thank you, guys. All right. Have a great one. Okay, man. Good job crime fighting today, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Good, good usage of those taxpayer dollars. Following orders. So they gave they gave Danny a five hundred dollar ticket last Daniel. Yeah, yes, they gave a, yeah they gave a fat ticket. Yeah. I'll and that. so now they're coming back. Um, Why would they give you one? That's a good question. Because they know another six. Yeah, I I think they're they're. Um, they probably said stop arresting Robbie and shit. We start making us look like assholes. Well, they're running a risk of of malicious prosecution because this this freaking this little like this ticket they're giving trespassing for camping. That, that flies in the face of uh, of law. You know, if they... and, oh, Seems let's... like suck my dick is trending right now. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, there you go. This is, this is, James giving them the business. I feel him, man. Yeah. I've been beat by the cops twice before I was 18, put in a coma once. I've never had a violent crime, ever. Yeah, man. If that shit happened today, it was something retired. Yeah. I think the days of these food liquors just getting away with whatever they want to is, is over and, and they're having a hard time accepting it and, and getting away from change. It's yeah. necessary. That's For them right. to have a good reputation. Again. Yeah, I know. Right. They, yeah, police, I mean, and Sausalito police especially. Oh, you, Robbie. You guys are today. It's so good. Yeah. They're like, Rocky, we recognize your, your uh, self-destructive behavior. We cannot... <laughs> <laughs> They told him today he needs to get a job. <laughs> I said, oh, he's doing a much better job than you guys. I know, I told, I told the judge what I was doing. She's like, you know, although it's admirable, your activism, I think it's a misplaced. Who said that? The judge in my CPS case. Oh. Oh. That's messed up. Like, Spoken like a true nimby, huh? Yeah, I'm like, I don't know what your community looks like, but I'm working on my community. Yeah, and straight up, I mean... Yeah, this is just what's going on. Oh, Lord have mercy. So do you think, I'm, I, you know, if I just pop up my little beach shake tent and sit in a chair here? Like a I think they'll give you a $500 ticket. Okay, yeah. You know, cause, so nobody can pop up a shade in a chair here? Anyway. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I'm a 